birth of a new baby is always joyous. How do you avoid sibling rivalry? Stay tuned. Nothing threatens your child's sense of normality quite like the addition of a new little brother or sister in the family. Your older child's world can feel shaken and insecure. And with the baby rightfully getting a lot of attention, your older child can easily feel overlooked. Before a baby even arrives, talk lots about the role the older sibling can play in the baby's life. Explain how fragile the new baby will be at first, but that soon they will grow big enough to laugh and play. Talk about how babies cry to communicate and spend lots of time reminiscing about when your older child was a baby. Look at photos together, tell cute stories, so they know exactly what to expect. Even the most prepared child can experience feelings of being left out though. So here's five ways that you can help the older sibling adjust during the baby's first year. Number one, make time every day for at least 15 minutes of special time with your older child. Try not to teach during these times. Just sit mindfully and non-judgingly. Observe your child's play. Give your full attention and your full approval. This can be done while the baby naps on the sling or in your arms. You don't need to pass off the baby to have connection time with your older child. Just consciously give 15 minutes of attention. No devices, no making cups of tea. Just being with your child and watching them adoringly as you do your baby. Smile lovingly, stroke their hair and pass no judgment. Number two. Notice when your child needs you most. Are they acting up when visitors arrive? Is it at bedtime pleading for you to stay with them? Are they begging for snacks the moment you sit down to feed or coo over your baby? However frustrating, remember all behaviour is an outward expression of an inner reality. They are telling you they need you too. Just preempting the behaviour and prepping snacks before you sit, reading stories downstairs or baby feed before bed. If visitors are cooing over the baby, take it as an opportunity for you to get an extra cuddle with your older child. Or if you're feeding your baby when visitors arrive or the baby is sleeping when they arrive, suggest they go and see your older child do with Lego creation and drawing or any reason there may be for the visitor to ooh and ah over your older child. So that's what they're craving. Number three, as the novelty of a new baby wears off, which is usually about three to four months in, be prepared for your previously accepting child to suddenly start to reject their sibling. The baby is here for good and life isn't going back to normal. Listen, listen lovingly. They mean no harm, but they do need the safety of your arms as they let go of the life they used to have and welcome in this new life of sharing their most treasured relationship relationship they have with you. So hold them, rock them, baby them a little. This too will pass. Telling them that they love their sibling and downplaying their upset does them no favours. Lend them in your ear non-judgmentally, allow them to feel cared for and heard and letting go will be so much easier for them. Number four, set your children up as a team. Create a clear-cut dynamic in the home, parents and kids. Talk about what is expected of the children as a whole, so the baby is included. Serve so family meals, even when the baby is too young to sit, and each they can still be in your arms or on your lap, and eventually, as they are able to sit, they can be in their high chair when they're introducing solids, or where the baby might need to be given more frequent meals than the older children, they can still focus, you can still focus on feeding at least the children, if not the whole family, together to build that sense of togetherness. Number five, have your older child help you look after the baby. Not as your helper, but as a loving gesture towards the baby. And take the time to thank them afterwards. You can say something like, Oh dear, I think Johnny needs me to get him out of napping. Oh, thank you, you're so kind for helping your brother. Pass it here and I'll change his napping. Number six, allow your child to overhear you talking to friends or family about how grateful you are for all the kind things your older child does. Not necessarily related to the younger sibling, but just in general, to help them understand how valued and loved they are. So give it a go, I'd love to hear from you. So let me know in the comments how you ease the transition in your home. 
If you liked the video, click like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.